it's Ruby Red's World of Dolls and welcome back. Thanks so much for tuning in with me today. I have another Barbie Fashionista review. This is number 100 and they call her Daisy Love. Now, she is one of those ones that haven't come out in all of the stores yet. I have seen some Facebook posts and Instagram posts of people saying that, you know, they've got these dolls at their Walmarts. It's like they get a few in and it's like one of each and they go so fast. But I have yet to see them at my local Walmart. So I had to turn to the next best option, which was Amazon. Amazon has these whenever you can catch them. You know, again, those third-party sellers, oh my God, the prices are crazy. But I have got this adorable cutie for $15.99, which is what they're normally selling for on Amazon.com. If you're blessed enough to get one for the regular price is what I call it. I love this doll. I have seen some um, reviews of her. And I love her face. Um, you guys, I hope that I can show you up close um, the freckles. She has freckles. And she's just so adorable. And I'm not too familiar with the Barbie face molds. I have said this before. Um, I do think that I have some dolls that do have that face mold but in different skin tones if that makes sense and I love her hair but I just wanted to show you guys what the packaging looks like and then again these are the dolls that are in this um, collection here and this is she that's Miss Daisy Love and I did a review on this adorable cutie here um, she was available on Amazon.com and she's a beautiful doll but I already have so many Barbies, so I probably won't get her unless she comes on clearance or something. Because I already have so many that look like her already. But this one here, I have yet to get her, and she's next on my list, so I'm hoping to get her next. But these are the four that I guess you could call it that come in this um, collection. And then we know that the box has the... Um, pictures of the other fashionistas these deluxe packs is what we're calling them um they don't have the pictures of them on the back of those but these are some of the dolls um these this one here number 95 87 94 um 92 not 89 and 98 and 97 and 90 now they are all available on um Amazon.com. They're not sold out. Now, number 93 was kind of hard to get, but she's now available. Now, let me say this. Sometimes being a Prime member, you're they're more accessible to you than not being a Prime member. So, that Prime membership comes in handy when you're trying to get rare and hard to find items. I have been signing up for email alerts for number 91. Um, I always get it too late and she's out of stock, but eventually she will become available and I'm just going to be patient and um, wait until she does. So I'm going to get this adorable Daisy Love out of the box so that we can get a closer up look at her. Now I don't mind opening these dolls on camera because these don't seem to take as long to get out of the packaging as some of the ones in the past. There's a few snip, snip, snips, and she's out. And we're going to get a closer up look at her. And something that I have found about um, these fashionistas that I've been getting in these little um, deluxe packs, they don't have those sticky things in their heads. So I don't know if this is just some that missed it or they're deciding to stop doing that because I'm not the only... Um, collector out there, consumer, whatever you want to call it, that has complained about those sticky things in the doll's heads. Okay guys, here she is and she is just fabulous. I am in love with this adorable doll. She is gorgeous. Let's start with girlfriend's fabulous hair color. Her hair color is just gorgeous. 
I am loving, loving, loving her hair color. Her hair color is just awesome. It's an auburn color, and it's curly, curly, curly. She's got curls, curls, curls for days, and I am loving it. And then she comes with a pair of plain black sunglasses, and they're pinned on her head. And then let's take a look at her face. You remember I told you guys she's got these freckles. And I'm loving it. Her freckles are so adorable. I am loving it. I love everything about Miss Daisy Love. She is just gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Now she appears to be of the regular body type. Um, she's wearing a yellow necklace there. Her dress is one piece, and I like it. I think it is really adorable. It looks like um, this top part. I, I used to know fabrics very well, but, you know, I, my mind has gone blank with things. You don't use it, you lose it. And um, this is kind of like, I'm not sure what kind of fabric you would call that, but it's really nice. Um, and then it has a pink stitch down the front there. And then the skirt part of the dress is made out of something different. It's not netting material, but it's really pretty. And then it has these little, um, this print here, these flowers on it. And it's pleats in it. And the design does go all the way around. And then underneath you have a pink skirt, um, underneath it. And it's really, really it really is pulled together, and I like that. I like how they got that pink underneath that blue, and it's really pretty. And then she's just wearing plain old silver, I would call them Oxford shoes. Nothing fancy about them either. They're just plain old silver Oxfords. And you can see the um, details there on the front. And they're flats, and she's flat-footed, of course. And she's just absolutely gorgeous. I am loving this doll, and I am so glad to be adding her to my Barbie collection. Now, she also came with this, um, I'll call this shoulder bag, an orange shoulder bag. More like a crossbody, maybe. Okay. And then she comes with this other extra outfit, and this is a little yellow skirt um, that Velcro's in the back there. And then it has the scallop hem. I really like that. That's really cute. Well, I'm wrong. It's not a skirt. I stand corrected. These are a pair of shorts. It's a pair of shorts. So they have the scallop hem, and they're really, really cute. So they're shorts, guys, not a skirt. And then it comes with this top here, and I really like the print, and I really like the fabric. I, don't, I really like this fabric. Really, really like it. It's heavy and really well made. I must say that I'm noticing that Mattel is doing a little bit better with the fabrics lately on the outfits of these dolls. I really like the top. I like the print, and it does Velcro in the back there, and I think it's really, really cute. I really like this little stuff that she comes with. Guys, I hope that you enjoyed this quick little review. I was so excited to get her and get her out of the packaging. And I wanted to share her with you guys before I um, took her out of the packaging. Because a lot of um, viewers like to see the packaging. So, thanks again for watching. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to subscribe. And guys, please leave me some feedback. What is your opinion on the new Barbie fashionistas? Are you um, as excited as I am about the new face molds and new body types that they're coming out with? What is your favorite so far? Do you have a heart to find one on your list that you're trying to get but you haven't got? Um, don't forget to leave me feedback. I love it. I love reading y'all's feedback. I have ordered another made to move. Um, so don't forget to subscribe so that you can get um, notified of when I get her. Because of course when I get her, you know I'm going to share her with you all. Guys, thanks again for watching. Have a super fantastic day. And I'll see you in my next review. Stay cool in the heat.